Oh, what's the matter, baby? You shy? No, I'm just hungry. Trey, babe, look at me, please. Okay, here I am. You have me on film, so can we please go and eat now? Hey! Gee, Scott, you're such a dick. When are you gonna grow up and leave him alone? It's not high school anymore. Oh, yeah? I guess I'd say about you. You're gonna drop this dweeb and come hang out with a real man. Huh? Stop fighting his battles. Actually, so he's got a pretty good point there. Look at him. He's soft. He came around like he's your little handbag. I see you hanging off Scott like you're his handbag. Come on, Sam, enough. It's time to go. Yeah, that's it, Trey. Run away with your tail between your legs, as usual. Soft as! See you later, turd. Peace out. Call me. Yeah, right, Scott. When are you going to stand up to them? You know they're going to keep bullying you like this. It doesn't matter. Trey, just drop it, Sal. I'm sorry. You're right, they're just being jerks. We're not going to let them spoil our night. Let's go start together, hey? Come on, really? Yeah, shut up and smile. So we gotta go now. Come on, let's go. Yeah, fuck.
gotta get off the streets. She's a nurse at the hospital. No. No, we're all separated when she hit the fan. So what happened to you two? Sally was attacked three days ago by one of those things. Everywhere was being invaded, so we had to run. Our families and friends, a lot of people just vanished on the first night. Hospital was our only hope. Thanks for letting us in. Probably not the best time to be having a baby, huh? It's not a baby. What do you mean? The creature did something when it attacked Stow. She was scratched and infected. And now something's growing inside of her. on mail was an emergency. These creatures must impregnate the women in order to multiply whilst taking out the male population. Your face. What happened? Two nights ago, people started coming into the emergency ward with stories that they'd been attacked by creatures. And some of them became enraged and hysterical and started attacking my staff. One of these creatures showed up and just ripped through the place. Did you get a good look at it? No, nah, no, it all happened too quick. I ran. I, I managed to escape with a handful of medical supplies, and, and that's when I ended up in here. Nat? Found it. Next to some poor victim. You're a doctor, right? I mean, shouldn't you try and fix it? This is all I can do without more medical supplies. Seems like a scratch from one of these creatures affects the male population differently. I know the infection is slowly spreading through my body. And given enough time, I'll end up like those back at the hospital. When it comes to that, I'll take the final pill. Can you help us? I don't know what I'd do if something happened to her. Please. And still, that's good. You should get some rest. I'll check on you again in the morning. Wait. Thank you.
about 10 centimetres oh. diameter. Let's see it coming. Oh. Oh. What's that for? It's not okay. If I can inject it directly into the skull, it should render it docile enough to not struggle through the delivery. Okay. Sal, you're gonna feel a little pressure. It's gonna be okay. It's working. It's okay. Yeah, I think so. We're not out of clear yet. Okay, Sal, look at me. When I tell you to push, you've got to push hard. Now push. Is it out? Yeah, it's out. Is it dead? I think so. <laughs> Up for me. It's over. We're gonna be okay. We all love you so much. Based on your 